Hello everyone, Rafael here at Taming the Orchid, coming at you from New York City quarantine. Hope you're all doing really, really well and keeping safe and healthy. I wanted to show you some quarantine blooms and uh, I've been really busy just uh, really focusing on my orchids and making sure everything is up to par, um, which I usually do anyway, but now I'm spending a little bit of extra time on them. And I've got some nice blooms, so let me just show you what's going on here. Uh, the first one is Brasso Cattleya Frank Gritsavi, and the clonal name is Roger, and there it is there. And you can see it's absolutely beautiful and lovely. And I got this plant back in March 2018 as a very small division. It is a division that came from Joe Gritsavi, who is a famed legacy grower. It came from his private collection, and as far as I know, this plant has never been cloned. So this is the original division and you can see how beautiful it is. And it has such a big bloom. It's Brasovla nodosa by Catlea Mary Grasavi, I believe. And um, it is just so pretty. And it has the most subtle speckling on the petals and sepals. And I just love the lip too. I really, really love it. It's beautiful. And then over here, I've got my Lelia Zip. And I call this guy the Lone Ranger because <laughs> this is a funny story. There was actually three blooms on it and I actually um, broke off two of the blooms by accident, which never happens for me, but that was a first. And this is a darker form of Lelia Zip and it is a stunner. And this is a primary hybrid and this is from Sunset Valley Orchids. And this is a first bloom for me too. And uh, let me just show you the other two blooms here. Here they are. And um, you can see they're just so beautiful. So that's what they look like together. Maybe over here. So absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous lip, gorgeous dark color. And um, I'll show you these plants also in natural light because this is under the plant light. But um, yeah, Rocco's over here and he wants to say hi. Hi Rocco. So, um, yeah, I'll show you what they look like in uh, natural light and uh, we will uh, see better in natural light. So just one second. So here are the plants in natural light. So you can see how beautiful this one is here. The Cattleya, uh, Brasto Cattleya, Frank Gritsavi, clonal name Roger. Um, really neat lip on it. You can see the subtle speckling in the petals and sepals. So beautiful. And here's the Catlea Zip, or Lelea Zip, I guess it's still called, which is a primary hybrid of um, Lelea uh, milleri, which is Catlea milleri now, by um, Tinebrosa, Catlea Tinebrosa. And um, these were dark parents that were used in that, and you can see that it's a very dark wine color. It's almost like a Cabernet color. Um, and it's really, really pretty. I really like it a lot. Let's see if I can put in the other blooms. That's what it would have looked like if these were here. Um, and it is just so pretty. I love the dark color. And these are extraordinarily large for a zip. I haven't seen zips this big before. And this is a first bloom, which means that as this plant gets stronger, they're just gonna get better and better. So I'm just so thrilled with this outcome so far. Same with this one. This is still a young plant, first bloom. I've got two more buds coming. And um, I'm gonna get some very nice you know, it's just gonna get better from here on in. So I'm just thrilled. And uh, I wanted to share these blooms with you and just cheer you all up a bit and hope you're staying safe and stay positive, stay cheerful and stay upbeat and um, talk to you soon and be well.